Here's how I add cinematic motion blur to all of my speed ramps in under 10 seconds. To start, I go to the effects panel and grab an adjustment clip and drag it over top of my speed ramps. Next, I search for my pre-built motion blur preset and drag it onto the adjustment clip. I then adjust the parameters as needed and fine tune the length of the adjustment clip to make it perfect. And now I have cinematic motion blur. And if you wanna get this preset for yourself, you can find more details in the description. But if you don't wanna buy a preset, I'm also gonna show you how to do it from scratch. So delete the motion blur pro. Go into the fusion page, hit shift spacebar and add an optical flow node. Now hit shift spacebar and add a vector motion blur node. Go to the center of your adjustment clip. With the vector motion blur node selected, keyframe scale at one. Now go back to frame zero and set the scale down to zero. Go to the last frame of your adjustment clip and set the scale at zero. Now open your spline editor, click scale, hit zoom to fit, grab all of your keyframes, hit S to smooth, and now hold control to get independent control of these handles and make a spike like so. And now you've just built your very own cinematic motion blur. But if you want to retime your speed ramps and your adjustment clip or make changes on the edit page that is not possible and that's why i'd recommend getting the motion blur pro plugin you also get a free version which is way faster on your computer and it also looks incredibly good details down below in the description